had that stretch where they lost nine in a row. I think some of the play with Zed Key is there's a Siegen off the ball, getting something in the painted area. And they've done a much better job of getting into the painted area and making plays for other people and themselves. Into the shot clock here, pulling into the mid-range jumper, it banks in. Brown just using his sides, back and suing down, and patiently scoring the rock. And they need the seven-footer crowd. Meanwhile, on the other end, it's the 6'2 freshman, Bruce Thornton. So the screen, the screener started in Spain. Is that well, the gist of it? Spain made it popular by, by screening for the actual screener. Okay, yes. the other way, three on one. Second bucket for number two, Bruce Thornton. Great mid-range game to like about Bryce Sensabaugh and his pro prospects. Well, McNeil is aggressive to him. He's got seven early. There's no reason why the Badgers can't find their rhythm and get right back in this thing. Last year, Greg oh, Gard, wow. Big Ten Coach of the Year. And what a move! Sean McNeil, have a night! They are putting a siege in actions, and they are making him guard. Yeah, Sean McNeil is just having a field day. He's 4-4 four four from the floor, and now it's Thornton laying it up and in. Well, whether Sitsabal comes back or not, on par at Thornton, that's a pretty good group to start building around. Absolutely. And there's Bryce Sitsabal in the mid-range. 0 of 4 in the first half for Chucky Hepburn. On the other end, missed at the rim, but a tap back for Felix Tonpar. Right now it's suing. He likes to get to this mid post, back to the bucket, fading. My goodness, the lead is 22. Meanwhile, Wisconsin folks just 7 of 26. They get 7 of 27, and now 7 of 28. Wall keeps it alive, and he finally gets one to drop. Chris Holman talks with him about better shot selection, and he's been selective tonight, just two of five. How about the fact he's got ten rebounds as well? Yeah, pretty impressive. Another turnover, here he is, and sets the ball We know he can do that. That's what he's done all year long. Another missed layup at the rim, but even as they walked to the huddle in the last time out, it just seemed like they're kind of asleep out here. And Ohio State is very much awake and alive. Two more for Sensabaugh. We got to play these guys. We said that a couple weeks ago as they were starting to play better, the Buckeyes, that is. And I think probably some people snickered when you heard that, but. Likely drive and kick. Suing thought about it. Suing, yes. And a foul. So many guys have contributed and scored, and. Yasijin has just not been able to find the range. Davis, how about him? Yes, after 10 straight misses, that's Wisconsin's first three of the night. Yasijin, what a move, what a finish! Connor Yasijin. Spinning inside, Wall. Back and down, doing what he does best. Bucket and the foul. Tyler Wall against Akpara. Here comes the double. And Akpara says, no, sir. Wisconsin, Tyler Wall spearheading this comeback, but still down 14. In the lane. Akpara with another rejection. Ohio State hasn't scored in over six minutes. Justice Suing changing that right there. It's a big time play. And in the driver's seat right now. Wall in the lane. There's that little hook. Suing doesn't want to pick up that fifth foul either. Sensible. Knocked out of bounds. Wisconsin has all the momentum all of a sudden. And this is an insane comeback. There are fans that are here. They're standing. That's left. Wow. Oh! Are you kidding me? All of a sudden, the tides have turned. It's a 19-2 run. And that's knocked out and off of Ohio State. Chucky Hepburn's going to play at night. Just the one shot that he hit here in the second half. He loves these threes in the game. He drives it, and he finishes against Eugene Brown. Rebound to his season. And that'll do it. Ohio State moving on to face Iowa tomorrow.